So I need to make the lab rooms now, which is different than the room rooms. So I'm here in my room C since it's already blank. And I'm going to file, make a copy, and I'm going to call this one lab B. I'm going to do it as all one word with no spaces. Okay. And looking at the sample out of the book, I see that the lab is more enclosed. It has like a ceiling. So first I'm going to make like all the colors a little bit darker. Uh, just make it different. I just want it to look different than the other room looks. So instead of a red carpet, I think I'm going to choose orange. And let's go ahead and make the walls blue. That'll be fun. Blue. And then I need to make the ceiling. It might be a little trickier. I'm going to copy and paste the floor. I'm going to pull this up here. Let's make a ceiling out of this. But I don't want to pull it all the way to the edge. Uh, I don't think that looks very good, but I'm going to go ahead and leave that as it is. And it looks like there's kind of a darker background on here, so I'm going to go ahead and make a rectangle for the background image. And I'm going to choose blue, but I want to make it contrast with the walls. So I'm actually going to go back to the paint can. I'm going to go to custom. So I have the blue here. I can actually darken up the blue or I can adjust the opacity which is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to bring the opacity down a little Excuse me. So now I've got this big blue thing on the front. I actually want to send this to the back. So I'm going to do command shift down and send it all the way to the back. Or I could have right clicked and done order send to the back. So now I have got my lab room or what it's going to look like. And what I need to do is I've got to build some big computer terminal in here. You know what I need to do is I need to pull this over that way a little bit. That will be a little bit better for my ceiling. And I just need to have a computer bay which looks like a giant trapezoid. So I'm going to go ahead and make a trapezoid. Make it pretty large. I'm going to make it gray. And then I'm going to get another trapezoid below it to make like the thing it stands on. I'm going to fill that in black and command shift down, send that, whoops, command up. And that to the back there. And then I need like a, a video panel in it. So I'm going to go ahead and use a rounded rectangle. And so I've got this video panel and I'll let it be light gray. And then I need some buttons here. So I'll make a circle, hold down the shift key. Fill it in black, copy, paste, copy, paste, copy, paste, okay that should do it. There is my lab B, so I file, download as, PNG, and I've got my background image.